Hello and welcome to cdrumhitdrum.com. I'm Randy Briggs and today I'm going to show you a nice little variation on a 16th note groove uh, that we've got in one of our previous lessons. But instead of playing it all on the hi-hat here, we're just going to move the right hand over to the ride cymbal. And you'll see this gives it a totally different feel. It's a bit of a different coordination, but it's also kind of flashy. I think you'll like it. Check it out. Okay, so what is that? Well, let's slow it down and, and let's take it over here for a little bit. One E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a one, right? Exact same thing, but your hands are split over these symbols right here. Your right hand's on your ride, your left hand's on your hi hat, being very syncopated as it were. And for the downbeats, the backbeats, the two and the four, your right hand travels over to your snare drum. Now this may be a new coordination for some of you guys, so take it, play it slow, play it low. And do that as many times as it takes until you just simply can't mess it up. Then you're going to add your right foot. Okay, and you'll come up with your own variations. And this, uh hi-hat over here you can you can make some variations here too you can get kind of saucy if you'll uh chalk your left hand down and start playing with the shoulder you can bring it out a little bit or you can keep your beat up on the top as we've talked about in other lessons and you can uh, kind of make it more articulate you can throw in accents on your left foot hand too okay so check this out So that's it, guys. Take it, play it slow, play it low, work out all the variations, come up with something you enjoy that you like to listen to and play and show other people. Make it your own, okay? And check us out again at cdrumhitdrum.com. I'm Randy, and take care. Yeah.